Hello, everyone. Welcome to this new episode of Tony Tangents. Today, uh, what we're going to be doing here is uh, we are going to be reacting to, uh, I guess, the new generation. I guess it's not very new anymore because I believe the website that I pulled the following Pokemon from is like from 2019. So it's not very new. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be reacting to uh, Gen 8 Pokemon. Now, uh, just to give you guys a little bit of background, I am a uh, uh, not a Pokemon virgin because I have played Pokemon before. I've played both uh, Gen 1 and Gen 2. Gen 2 was the last fucking Pokemon game that I've ever played. And it was... Uh, I, I've played uh, all three of uh, Gen 2, uh, Silver, Gold, and Crystal. And that was years ago. And uh, after that, I just forgot about Pokemon and I didn't really give a fuck uh, about Pokemon since. So, um, yes, Pokemon was great uh, when, you know, when I was younger and shit. And it was a lot of fun. It was a, a fun game. And uh, unfortunately, uh, from what I understand, the games have gotten kind of weird uh, as of late. They've gotten they've gotten weird. Their Pokemons have gotten like ugly looking. I mean, let's just look at these Gen 2 Pokemon so, like, to compare. I mean, a lot of them are based off of, like, animals and shit, right? And stuff. Like, I don't know what this one's based off of, uh, this ugly-looking thing. Uh, but a lot of them, they're, they're just really cool designs. And, I mean, I'm assuming that when you have so many designs over the years, uh, you stop getting both creative and uh, you just kind of, like, because I, you know, I, I would draw shit when I was a kid. You know, I, I used to make my own fucking like playing cards and stuff. And uh, I would run out of ideas to draw for design. So I would just make stupid looking shit. Um, so uh, I'm assuming that a lot of these Pokemon are going to be like that. They're going to look like either ripoffs of other Pokemon or they're just going to be random things. Um, so, yeah, anyway, uh, again, I've never seen these Pokemon before. And I'm just going to give you guys my hot takes on on what uh, these Pokemon look like and uh, whether or not I like their designs. So. All right, so Grookey uh, turns into Thwacky and Rillaboom. Okay. <laughs> okay, so um, here we have a monkey, right? We have a little green cute monkey. I like the design. I think it's really cool. Um, so he's got a stick, right? So when he's a monkey, he's got one stick. When he evolves, uh, uh, the stick turns into two sticks, and those sticks uh, look a lot bigger from what I see, from, from what we're looking at here. So uh, in his, in his uh, nymph stage, he's got one stick, and then when he, uh, you know, you know, like in animals, like fucking bugs, they pupate, and then whatever, they uh, metamorphosize into something else. Um, this stick that's attached to his hand uh, genetically attached to his hand turns into two sticks and now he's got two larger sticks and then not only does he does he go from a monkey with one stick to two sticks but then he he transforms from being like a primate like a monkey into being an ape so he loses his tail uh, grows grass on his head and uh, this uh, stick turns into a uh, drumstick right uh, and he's got a drum, a tree drum. So uh, what's going on here? Like, does does he find a log that looks like that with, like, stubs? And then does he find, like, an actual fucking drumstick? And then does he just play the drum? Like, what's going on here? Rilla boom. So he's a gorilla that goes boom. So I'm assuming he's a percussion player. He's If he was in a band, he would be the percussion player. And uh, this is stupid. Like, why... Why is this animal attached to, like, why does he have to have fucking a log, you know, and a, and a drumstick that looks like it was machined by a lathe? Ridiculous, right? I know other Pokemon, like in Gen 1, there was Cubone, right? He's got a bone and a skull, like, that's his mom's bones and, and that kind of shit. That, that always annoyed me about Pokemon. It's like, just show me the damn animal, right? Why do you have to show me his accessories? Why does he have to have accessories when he's born? Why does he have to evolve with different accessories? That doesn't make any fucking sense. So, score bunny. Okay, so we have a bunny. 
turns into a rabbit. Cute, cute bunny, by the way. Uh, rabbit. Um, all right. Still cute. And then he turns into Cinderace. So, okay, so I'm assuming this is the grass starter. This guy's the fire starter. Um, all right, and he, here he looks like Lucario, like a Lucario ripoff. Um, I know of Lucario because I've seen some of the Pokemon movies, and he's in Smash Bros. So anyway. Sobble. I think I've seen this guy before, right? I've seen, I've seen this guy before somewhere. All right, so anyway. So Sobble, he's ugly. He's sad. He's a sad-looking squirtle copy here turns into a fucking salamander of some sort with green hands uh and green feet um and uh you know whatever he's got a fucking chameleon looking tail and then he just turns into the bad guy from fucking uh, uh monsters inc okay uh blip bug what is that what is that what the fuck is that? Look at this. What? Why is it? Is he always perpetually looking to the side like that? Or like, see, this is what I'm talking about. Like they get less creative. So they just make random ass designs. Like, what are these? What are these things? Are these his ears? Okay. So he's, he's, he's like a caterpillar. So he's got those like false caterpillar feet. And then are these feet? What's up with this slit? Is that it's like, uh, is this a female with like a vagina? What's going on here? That's a tail. I can tell that's a tail. Okay. So then it evolves into this thing. It This, which has no like discernible sort of shape or anything like that, turns into a fucking uh, Dungeons and Dragons dice die. Uh, still has the stupid looking eyes here. And then it's got these like, triangle hand or uh, uh chevron hands uh still got like four feet okay then it just turns into a straight up ladybug called or beetle this is cool i like i like this this the final form of this shit looks pretty cool but who designed this who who approved this who drew this and then who was like the guy that was like yeah dude that looks like a pokemon whatever Okay, so we have Skull, Scalvet, um, a squirrel uh, that stores shit in its mouth, obviously, right? And then, and then look, to make it look different, right, they add this thing. What is that? What is that, dude? Like, whoever designed this was like, you know what? We, we got to make it look different from a squirrel. So we're just going to add these random appendages on its tail, right? And like, so that means, right? If you've ever seen a squirrel's tail, right? It's like it's like a rat tail with fuzz, right? So this, from what it, you know, from from the looks of it, looks like a solid mass of of flesh, and it's got these two appendages sticking out. What what are these? Are these sexual organs? What, what's going on here? And then why? What's this? What is that? Is that a growth on its back before the tail can sprout? Like uncreative uncreative design they didn't know what they were doing they were just like make it look different make it look not like a real squirrel so then when it evolves it evolves into this jolly fat squirrel it's got the same weird looking ears whatever which is okay and then of course they need to add like lumps right to make it look different and then not only that then they add even more appendages more weird uh things that stick out Okay, so we got a a, a, uh, a skunk called Zigzazoon, or or actually, fuck, uh, a uh, raccoon, Zigzazoon, and uh, he's 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 all zigzaggy, right? So they make him look like that. Okay, fine, I'll accept it. He's got star eyes. You know, he looks like he looks like uh, uh, Gene Simmons with the tongue out. Then he turns into this thing, like a centret thing looking thing. Uh, weasel looking thing linoon okay this is this is sounding what the fuck they named this guy obstagoon that's racist that's straight up racist obstagoon uh well, game freak there we go game freak what were you guys thinking with the name here i've seen this before i think um choodle 
like a squirtle, but it chews and it's probably a water type. Yeah, water. It evolves into another fucking Blastoise looking thing with a... This this guy's face looks like something from the movie Robots, in it? <laughs> he looks like the fucking main character from Robots. All right, this is acceptable. I'll accept it. It's all right. Okay, so now we have another generic fucking dog. I'm assuming it's electric type. You know how I, I'm assuming that without even knowing? Because uh, he's yellow. He's yellow. So he has to be electric type. That's how we know he's electric type. Let's see. Let's see if that's true. Yamper electric. I was right. Right on the money. So predictable. Turns into bolt und. Bolt und. You know, like like houndoom. You know, we got to make sure people know he's a dog. Uh, so we add und at the end. All right, this design's cute. I like it. It's acceptable. I would like one of these. And you know, if I were to play Gen Gen Eight, I would like to have one of these. These are cute. All right. So we got a centipede. We got a uh, a centipede looking guy with circles because because he's a Pokemon and he he needs symbols on himself. And then uh, th this is a cool design. It's minimalistic. It makes sense. You know, they're not adding weird shit to him. Um, I like the eyes. They're very cool. And then it turns into this. You know what? I'll accept it. It's it's cool. It's a fire type, obviously, because it's red and it's got flame mustaches, appendages. And then he's got the fucking he's uh, he ate something spicy. So he's shitting out fire. He's farting out some fireballs here, some habanero fireballs, sizzlepeed and uh, centacorch. Very cool. All right. Fire and bug type. Wow. Interesting. So does that mean that, uh, yeah, so it's a bug type that's like immune to fire, which is cool, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. So we got a fire rock type, right? Or a lava rock type. I don't know what the difference is. Um, look at this. This is stupid. This is like a geodude. So they were like, make a geodude, but different. Um, how do you do that? You just make random ass jagged geometric shapes and there's your Pokemon. There's your design. Then you, what is this? What am I looking at? What the fuck is this? Obviously these are embers, right? And he's like, he looks like a fucking molcajete. If you guys have ever seen those, uh, where you, where you make your salsa in and he's just got a whole bunch of fucking coals in there. Okay. Um, and then he turns into this fucking thing where he's got even more coals and now he's got four arms so you know he's dangerous he can punch you and kick you as opposed to crawl around and as opposed to floating around roly coal <laughs> car coal and colossal okay cool see okay here's another one of those fucking you ran out of ideas, so you're just going to make a blob with appendages, more appendages, and a circle. Put a circle there to make it, you know, make it different. And then it turns into a fucking cake. Into a, 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 a fucking strawberry shortcake looking thing with strawberries here. Is this, what is this, the cake Pokemon? The pastry Pokemon? The meringue Pokemon? Come on, guys. Milsery, so he's... Like uh, uh, Al Creamy. Okay, whatever. Fairy. Of course, it's a fairy type. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is all. This is pissing me off. So this is an apple, right? Um, straight up apple. We're assuming those are its eyeballs because it needs eyes, right? Um, who knows what kind of fucking moves this does other than tackle? Then you peel it. And it's got like a fucking chameleon looking thing. It's got a fucking Geico uh, guy over here. And then, oh, what's going on here? Did I click on? Okay. It's got a Geico looking guy here. And then it just turns into a fucking dinosaur with bread. Looks like pan de muerto if you've ever seen that before. Uh, okay. Applin, Flapple. An apple ton. Jesus Christ. Okay, so this is, I've seen this guy before, far fetched, right? And then when he evolves, get this, guys, get this. When this bird 
evolves his uh 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 bok choy that he's holding here or whatever that is turns into a sword right and not only that but but out of his fucking wings he grows a shield made out of uh uh brussels sprouts or whatever the fuck that is i'm really disappointed in game freak they're still they're still adding uh accessories to pokemon that somehow when when that animal fucking mutates those accessories somehow somehow magically um apparate on their hands sir fetched yeah okay fuck off fuck you fuck you all right so it's a fighting and not even a flying okay what is this this is a bear trap is this the bear trap pokemon and then it turns into uncreative ass fucking design that uh, uh some guy who fucking hates his life because he's been fucking designing seven generations of pokemon ran out of fucking ideas so he made another fucking ambiguous blob um and then uh it turns into a tree it just turns into a fucking a white tree stunfisk corsola and cursola okay so so we're even going to be uncreative with the names here. We're just going to change one letter. One letter and it'll be different. Huh? That's what we're fucking doing? Okay, so we have here a pelican, a booby. I don't know what kind of bird this is supposed to be. And then it turns into a, a fucking... Turns into that baby dinosaur from the dinosaur sitcom. You know what I'm saying? Um, and then it turns into this. Which is a... A lizard. Cramorant. Toxel. Toxricity. The toxicity in our city. Flying in water. Okay, so I see. I see. So, so this one doesn't really have anything to do with this. The other Pokemon that don't really look like each other don't really evolve into the latter. Okay, I understand. I apologize, guys. I just, at this point, nothing really surprises me. What is this? What is this? Where are your feet, bro? What the fuck, man? What? Let's also give him a mascara look here. Uh, just to add nuance to the design. Yeah, let's do that. And then let's turn him into a fucking tire. This looks like a boa, by the way. I don't know how a fucking pug turns into a boa. I'm going to guess this is a grass type. Silicobra. Okay, this is a snake somehow. Somehow this is a snake. And it turns into Sandaconda. Okay. Ground. Ground. Of course it's ground. You idiot. You see, you see what I'm talking about? Don't you see what I'm like? Can't you understand why I have a fucking problem with the newer, newer gens of Pokemon? Like, what is this? What is that? I, I know I've been saying the same thing, just asking what things are, man. But this is like, this is, first of all, this is some cubism artwork sort of shit going on. And this, this is like, uh, I don't know what I'm looking at, man. I This is like a Mahjong piece combined with a fish with hands. And then it just, it turns into that, which makes no sense. It there's no logic behind this design. Again, they just ran out of designs and they were just like, dude, just just make fucking Mahjong pieces and fucking give them fucking weird looking hands and attach them with ribbons with fucking, you know what I'm talking about? Uh, those uh, like for fucking connecting certain parts of, of uh, 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 processors, you know, you have those ribbons. Yeah, just use that and then give them sausage fingers. Your mask. It's a mask? Runer, Runerigus. Okay, it's made out of runes. Why does he look like that, though? You could have made something way more, way less abstract looking with runes. You could have done something way better. All of these artists, man, should be fired. Snom and Frostmoth. 
Um, that's a pupa. Makes sense. And that's a moth. Makes sense. Gets a pass for me. I like the minimalist design. Whoever did this, don't fire them. I totally get what they were going for. Yeah, ice and bug. Cool. That is a cuttlefish, right? With, again, you have to make it look different, so you got to add weird shit, weird appendages. This is an octopus-looking thing that's a fighting type, I'm sure. And this is a sea urchin with testicles on the front, right? Clopobus, yeah, yeah, opobus, yeah, yeah, I get it, get it. Grab blocked, yeah, yeah, octopus. And pinchering, pincherchin, okay, pincherchin, yeah, sea urchin with no pinchers, which is weird, pincers, which is weird, okay. Oh, of course, it has to be electric because it's got yellow. All right, here we have uh, everyone's favorite uh, um, um, uh, sexual uh, predator. Pokemon, Mr. Mime, a variation of Mr. Mime. This time he's got mittens. Uh, yeah. And uh, he turns into this, who's got a face here. He's got a belly face with a cane because he, he has, when he evolves, when Mr. Mime evolves, he needs to have a cane materialize out of nowhere. Right? Mr. Rhyme. <laughs> okay, Mr. Rhyme. Interesting. So he, he rhymes now. Okay. I don't know what I'm looking at, guys. I really don't know what I'm looking at. Uh, this is like a... What is this? What's up with his hands? What's up with this fucking color scheme? Again, they don't know what they're doing at this point. Like, none of this none of this makes any sort of sense. They, they, they're just like, make it look different, so we're going to give it a stupid-ass fucking color scheme. We're going to give it swirls, so it looks different. And, uh, yeah, this is... And then it turns into this. Oh, I'm assuming uh, this one's a water type. And this is a uh, water something. Water and dragon. Okay, my gosh. Dracovish, it's a dragon. And Arctovish, cool. Whatever, fuck you. So that's like a sea lion. Oh, get this, guys, get this. When it evolves, it evolves a fucking larger parent. And this guy gets to ride him. And then when this evolves, now there's two. Now, now, see, this is what happens. This guy splits into two different guys. And then he gets loaded into this guy who's got fucking head cannons. And there you go. There's there's the same species, right? Uh, but uh, now it's composed of three different entities. Dreepy, Dracloak, and Dragapult. I fucking hate Game Freak, man. This is so stupid. I've seen this before. This is like a Suicune uh, fucking... This is, they plagiarized Suicune here. Um, and gave them, of course, sausage links. And then here, they 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 made, made them like a warrior type with wings. You gotta, you gotta give them wings to make them look different. Those sausage links, of course, naturally, of course, they evolve into ambiguous shapes organic shapes of course this is kind of cool looking i guess um you know what i will accept it i will accept it 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 doesn't really look like anything and you can tell they 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 were just fucking around when they drew this but i like the vertebra here look i like that it looks like some sort of insect with geometric shapes sure we'll accept it Eternatus. All right, whatever. Poison Dragon. And that's it. Anyway, go fuck yourself, Game Freak. I hate you. Uh, you're not very creative. And uh, you guys better fire your fucking artists because you guys are a fucking embarrassment. Um, if you're going to make a game, uh, make sure that your designs make sense. Um, you know what? These guys are making millions, if not billions of dollars you know, every time they fucking release these games. So at least something's working for them. But I can see through your fucking bullshit game freak. I can see through it. You guys need better artists. How come Magic the Gathering artists, you know, that have to like literally paint paintings? 
can continuously provide good art? Hmm? How come, how come, how come they can do it? And you guys, you guys just fucking, let's put swirls on this fucking guy. Let's make him look different. Let's, let's put sausage links on him. And then when he evolves, the sausage links turn into that, you know? Uh, uh, I hate you guys. Fuck you. I'm glad I stayed in Gen 2. Gen 2 has its problems, man. It has its bad designs. Don't get me wrong. But at least we don't have fucking... Let's see. At least we don't have fucking this shit. At least Gen 2 doesn't have... Whatever the fuck this is, man. Whoever the fuck came up with that, go kill yourself. I'm kidding. Don't. But reevaluate your fucking life. Okay? You should not be designing Pokemon ever again, okay? Especially, what, what is this? What is that? What is that? You're just, why is the eye in the shape of a fucking Q? And what? Yeah, yeah, um, I'm done. Uh, thank you for joining me on this, this uh, episode. Um, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, I'm, I'm going to, I'm, I'm just going to fuck off and uh, be pissed off for the rest of the, this ruined my day is down the road. Peace.